Well, good morning, everybody. Hope everybody's having a great start to your day. Happy Thursday. Uh, my name is Jeff Street. I teach people how to make money from home online. And today I want to talk to you about winning the battle of your emotions. Man, you know, emotions, they can sometimes get the best of us, can't they? You know, and sometimes we can go out and get the best of them. So let's talk about changing the emotional patterns that are controlling your life. Do you know that 60% of Americans feel that the future is going to be worse than the past? People feel like they're going to be worse off, you know, down the road than they were, you know, previously. And, and see, I think, good morning, Lori. We all hear of, you know, mind over matter. You know, mind over matter is something that we hear about all the time. But today I want to talk to you about mind over your emotions. See, that's that's the true battle. And I was listening to a Tony Robbins audio this morning, you know, about emotions. And that's one thing to win the battle about your, you know, emotions. When you feel yourself in a negative, you know, emotions, you listen to an audio about positive emotions and it'll go on to help you to change your state. Geraldo, good morning, brother. So one of the things that he was talking about is he talked about making a list. You know, making a list on a one side of the list, there's, there's what's on one side of the list, and then there's what's on the other side of the list. And on one side of the list is the emotions that empower you, the emotions that you have each and every week, things that you feel every single week that makes you feel empowered, makes you feel good. You know, then there is on the other side of the list, there's the emotions that disempower you. Things that make you feel bad, your negative emotions. Maybe it's, you know, feeling frustrated. Maybe it's feeling overwhelmed. Maybe it's fear. You know, maybe it's uh, uh, feeling worried. Maybe it's feeling angry. These are all disempowering, you know, emotions. And he said, go through the list. And he said, on each side of the list, on the positive side and on the negative side, circle the top two emotions, the top two that affect you negatively and the top two that affect you positively, you know, circle those two and take a minute and really think about those. You know, think about those negative ones, how they make you feel. Think about the positive ones, you know, how, how they make you, you know, feel. And, you know, when we're feeling sick, we go to the doctor, you know, to get prescribed an antidote you know, a medication. And, and when you look at these emotions, the empowering and the disempowering emotions, you have an opportunity to go out and really provide an antidote, you know, for yourself. If your negative emotion is fear, you can change fear with a positive emotion that's courage. Now, one thing I can tell you, fear doesn't go away. You know, when it comes to courage, a lot of times you're scared to death. You just go out and do something anyway. But that feeling of courage replaces that feeling of, 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 of fear. So we talked about, think about what do you do to feel positive and what do you do that makes you feel negative and really become aware. Start with those top two things, those top, good morning, Camille, good morning, Jimmy. Start with those top two things, those, the top two positive emotions and the top two negative emotions and get really present to those things. And, and here's what you do. When your cup is filled with the negative emotions, here's what you do. You dump it out and, and you pour those positive emotions inside that cup in, in, instead. So work on how can you replace those negative emotions with the positive emotions and have that be something that you're very, very present to. Again, those two positive emotions. And when you feel yourself feeling the negative emotions, just get present to that and take that cup and pour in, you know, pour into your cup those positive emotions. So, you know, what you got to do is you got to fill that cup. Fill that cup with the positive emotions when you feel the negative emotions. Treatment. See, negative emotions are something that's going to be part of all of our lives. You know, they say we all have more negative thoughts than we do positive thoughts. I know Joel Hulk is on here. I, I, I know Joel was doing a challenge trying to go through a whole day without feeling a negative thought. And here's what he said. I've been doing it every single day and I haven't had the victory over that battle once. But each day I've got more and more positive thoughts and emotions because it's something than a present to. So Mark Kent just said it best, fill that cup. So everybody drop a comment that says, fill that cup. So fill that cup with the positive emotions, the negative emotions come, get present to it. This is something you'll get better and better and better at over time. But once you feel those negative emotions, just pour that, you know, fill that cup, pour in those positive emotions so you can go out and change your state. So guys, have an incredible day. Pour those positive emotions, you know, in, into your life today. Life's a constant battle. It's, it's, it's a battle between good and evil.
It's a battle between positive and negative. We're always going to fight the battle. We just got to go out and tip the scale. So tip the scale by filling that cup. Good morning, Barbara. Good morning, Geraldo. Hope you guys have an incredible, incredible day. Uh, my name is Jeff Street. I teach people how to make money from home, online. God bless everybody. Joanne, Rick, good morning. Dina, good morning. God bless everybody. Have an incredible day. And I'll see you tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. East Coast time. Have a great day, everybody.